hello everyone welcome to pande groji youtube channel in this video i'm going to discuss about the tiger analytics data analytics interview question so uh, one of my student uh, attend the interview for the data analytics uh, the company name is tiger analytics and uh, uh, he asked uh, uh, mostly uh, i think uh, 9 or 10 question and uh, student share me uh, four question which is not able to uh, answer so if you attending also the any interview and if you not able to solve the question uh, you can email me the question uh, i will provide the email address on my uh, video description so the first question they ask basically uh, based on the uh, some aggregated function and the join so the first question is find the top 10 highest total unit cost of the product so unit cost is the basically for each and every product uh, we have uh, some unit co cost uh, every unit like one uh, uh, product have uh, 100 unit or one product have uh, 2000 unit so basically they ask question based on the uh, adventure work database so he provided the sample database of the adventure work so this is the real time uh, technical interview okay so he share the table each and every information both the table so you can see in the both table one table we have product information uh, second table we have the fact information fact table uh, basically we have the unit cost of the product so each product you need to be figure out you need to find out top 10 product so you can see in product table we have uh, a different different type of the product is there so this is the first question the second question ask based on the uh, this is the related to some type of the uh, performance tuning also we can say also we have uh, some real time experience so this type of the question basically asked to filter out uh, uh, the fake experience or the who not work on the uh, SQL area and try to move into the database area. So this is a very repeatable question we always see in the interview. So the second question is uh, what is set ANSI null on? So when we set uh, ANSI null on or off, what will be the impact? He asks share the real time uh, example the using in the uh, working environment what situation you will use this uh, ANSI null on in SQL server the third question is basically ask uh, what is the offset in the SQL and uh, we also have what is the alternate use of the offset or the what is the alternate use of the top clause so in interview they ask basically what is the offset but uh, uh, they can also ask uh, what is the alternate way to use the top clause. Uh, last fourth question is very interesting question. So basically they uh, they uh, provide put it some basically uh, one uh, store procedure and they ask to find the top 10 major problem okay. 10 major problem in the store procedure so they provided this code so you need to be debug the code you need to be see the code and you need to be tell that uh, if you are the developer what is the major problem in the store procedure is there okay so basically uh, just you can pause this video and you can try to solve this question and this question i will provide you in the uh, video description you can go in the video description you can copy and uh, this code is also will provide in the video description and uh, you can try to answer and uh, you can paste the answer uh, in the comment section so to just to you can realize suppose if you attend the interview so you are able to uh, solve this question or not so just you can pause and you can solve it then you can see the answer so let's start one by one uh, i will i will try to solve each question uh, one by one very effective way uh, very easy way okay so basically uh, the first question is asking is uh, uh, find the top 10 uh, uh, highest total unit cost of the product okay 
so top 10 uh, means you need to be first find you need to be figure out that how we can uh, uh, find it okay so basically we have two table so definitely we need to be joined okay on the both the table so first you can put the select star from okay so no, I'm not don't want to waste the timing so I already have the code okay so you can see I joined this table okay so on based on the product key and uh, once we join this uh, both the table you will get the uh, matching record based on the product key so basically the asking is the uh, to, uh, high uh, top 10 total unit cost okay so I'm just uh, taking the sum of the value so we basically a uh, unit cost we taking the sum so if you run this code you can see you, you sorry uh, you will get the uh, basically uh, total unit cost but they asking the question is the top 10 product so we need to be figure out based on the product okay so based on the product we need to be group the you need to be use the group function okay so just you need to go step by step you can use the product key so uh, now you will you getting all the unit cost but we need the for every product so now you will get the for every product so you can see we, we cannot see the product name okay so you can put this select statement in the select statement okay so now you can see you you get all the product okay but uh, uh, they are asking top 10 highest so to top 10 highest you need to be use the order by clause okay order by clause is basically used to uh, order the data so we have uh, uh, you need to be use the order by three descending order okay so if you order so you can see this is the top unit cost okay but they are asking top 10 okay so simply uh, you can use the uh, top 10 uh, here okay so if you use the top 10 clause here okay so you will get the top 10 so if you go any question step by step so this is the product information of the uh, top 10 based on the total cost of the uh, every product okay unit cost okay so you can see top uh, one is the row 250 rate 58 this is the product name okay so like this we can uh, basically uh, solve this problem now uh, coming to the uh, second uh, problem what is set ENSI null on so basically uh, set ENA, ENSI null on or off is basically used uh, when we uh, using the uh, like uh, if you using the comparing the value like uh, set null value okay so the uh, so it will be not applied so let's understand what object we have the definition here okay and we'll go also by uh, some uh, uh, real time scenario so basically if ensi null is set to on and if you can apply equal to not equal to on the null column value so while the writing select statement then it will not return any result let's see the what example we have because if you understand through the example so you will better understand okay so i'll provide the example in the video description also okay you can download all this content so uh, let me uh, create one temp table and we need to be insert some null value okay so you can see uh, serial number three we have the null value okay so if you use the set nc off okay so if you use the set nc off and name is equal to null so this will be one row affected okay so you can see uh, this value will be one row affected okay but if you use the set ANC on okay so if you use the set ANC on the the same statement will value will be there is no will uh, there is no row will be affected okay so when e name is equal to null when set null on if you put the on the value will be not appear if you put the any equal statement same like not equal to also you can see this will be also will they will not return any value okay so this is the uh, second question now coming to the third question 
the third question is saying that what is the offset in the sequel okay so basically uh, offset is uh, basically used to uh, uh, means a uh, top clause in alternate way of the top clause like the same uh, record same table temp table what we use here okay so if you use the offset zero row so there is no row will be skip okay so if you put this top as offset two okay so they will basically skip two rows okay so offset will be uh, basically used to uh, skip the row okay so if you have in the table 100 row and if you want to uh, skip top 50 row okay so you can use the offset okay alternately uh, this uh, you can also use the top uh, cloud like uh, if you use the in, if you want to retrieve the bottom 50 so you can use the ascending or descending order and offset will be always used with the order by cloud okay now coming to this uh, uh, store procedure so this store procedure you can uh, find see the we have a major problem so basically uh, we'll go one by one and we will see what is the uh, major problem we have okay so you can see the first major problem is uh, they put an incorrect procedure name we cannot use sp underscore the second major problem you can see uh, some something like some table they not use the correct uh, schema name uh, or the some uh, schema name is also uh, missing uh, so this is the second major problem uh, basically in the procedure we always use the begin and end okay so no use of the begin and end uh, set no count on is also not used okay uh, majorly when we write the store procedure we also use the set nc on so this is also not used in the procedure uh, basically unnecessary distinct is also applied okay so uh, performance wise if you use the distinct each and every uh, column this is this will be very bad performance okay uh, if you have all the joint put in in one place so you we can also use the you uh, in place of the union temp table and we can create the some type of the indexing okay uh, correct state correct join is also used or not okay so this all the uh, use so we need to be always consistent if you're using all the small letter you need to use but basically uh, if you're writing the procedure we always give the some type of the good uh, uh, parameter name uh, good column name okay like customers id should be c capital id should be capital like this so this all the major issue we have in this code so i uh, hope you understand uh, this all the question uh, if you attend if you attending any interview question in next and uh, if you're not able to answer the question uh, you can uh, simply email me I will provide the email address on the you can uh, you can take the email address from description also video description also okay so thank you so much for the watching complete this video if you have any question doubt you can put the question in video description comment thank you